I'd like to derive some equations for you. There's five big equations that tell us about motion when things constantly accelerate. And there are five givens that you might know about an accelerating object. And so typically with these equations, you need to know three of these givens, and you can solve for the fourth. And what I'd like to do is derive one equation at a time for you. So in this video, we're going to derive VF equals VI plus AT. There are a couple ways we can do that. Again, this is what we're going for, VF equals VI plus AT. One way of doing that is to say, well, if I make myself a little table of 0 seconds, 1 second, 2 second, 3 second, and so on, I come up with a generic expression. If I start with an initial velocity, and my velocity changes by A each second, then after one second, I'll have A more velocity than I did the one before. After two seconds, I'll have an additional A more velocity, or VI plus 2A. After three seconds, I'll have an additional A velocity, or VI plus 3A. And if I extend that out to T seconds, then I'll have VI plus TA. And hopefully you can see that this expression for velocity is basically the same one at the top that tells me at the end, I have to say where did I start and how much did the velocity change by. This is another way of saying change of velocity. So starting velocity plus change in velocity tells me my ending velocity. What a lot of students like better for a derivation is to think about a velocity time graph and to say if I start at some velocity and I want an expression for the velocity at the end, it's really a line. So I'm really kind of saying y equals mx plus b. And then I just have to think, what's y? y is velocity. And if I want to know the y at the end, it's my velocity final. What's m? m is the slope. And for a velocity graph, the slope is a. What's x? In this case, it's time. What's my y-intercept, my b? That's where I started, vi. So again, hopefully you can see this looks like the equation at the top, vf equals vi plus at. There are a couple other ways to do it, but hopefully that gets you started for now.